Long Island's Diamondback Terrapins just got the ultimate present for World Turtle Day. On May 23rd, the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation partnered with several local groups to introduce a new regulation that will help save many of the species' lives. Due to a variety of activities, direct human harvest, being hit by cars when they come ashore to nest, drowning in crab pots, the populations of terrapins have plummeted. To combat the declining number of terrapins in the area, the DEC now requires crab fishermen to add terrapin excluder devices and the commercial traps. It's a major issue. Um, hundreds of terrapins a year drown in crab pots. They go in to get the bait, you know, they smell the, the bait that the, the baymans put in there, but they, they can't work their way back out and ultimately they drown. It's too small for most of them, especially the uh, females, the adult females, and so they're trying to get in, but no matter how they move their shell, they can't get in. The DEC says the ruling is the first of its kind in New York State, and it couldn't have happened without the collaboration of the different organizations that were involved. It was very helpful. They came in with uh, some different ideas than we had and different resources. So if you want to continue crabbing in waters like the Carmen River here, you need to call the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation, which will be supplying free turtle excluder devices. We will list the number below in our article. I'm Nick Esposito from greaterbayshore.com.